my name is Luke Protopis and I am a member of the band Honey Glaze. The process for writing, you know, every time it's a little bit different. It's always good to explore trying to do things a little bit differently. It's, it's rare that you'll ever just write a, write a song from beginning to end and, you know, note by note, piece by piece. It's usually you find one thing and you like it, but then you realize that it works actually for something else even better. And I think that that's what I really enjoy most about writing is seeing the progression of something that you're making, seeing how it can grow and how you, your influence can shape something into something that is creative and unique and true to oneself. So Borderline Billy is a song that I wrote recently, but to me that, that song is not losing yourself to trends and conventions that are set through the media age that we're in. It's almost like deciding to sell out in a way and accepting that fate, but also turning back on it and learning from that decision and growing because of it. signal had to keep it proper i'm keeping it civil lost another friend won't admit that i miss him take a listen lean in read the mannerisms i'll make a million just to pay attention it's my decision to feed the addiction resolution faded like i'm picking my way through the pixels repetition day two level four see you soon let him take off from a place of love singing competition freshman year called uh, Dub Idol. I met some really cool people through that and, and I kind of got some reassurance that I was capable of doing stuff like this. And ever since then, I've been utilizing those relationships that I've made with people and finding ways to collaborate. And it's been a pretty natural process. There's not, there's not been much negativity around it. Everyone around here that I've met through music is awesome and very open and, and passionate and it's a great environment to be working and growing as a musician and I'm very grateful for it. Lovers of Disease is a song that I wrote years ago. <laughs> I've never really known what I would do with that song. My, my music style has changed a lot in those years, but it's always fun to go back and look at the mindset that I was in when writing old tracks. But that song really, to me, is sort of a, an opportunity to embrace the quote-unquote 
disease within oneself and learning to love those things about yourself, all the imperfections, not just accepting them, but loving them. My mother, she told me not to worry, but sick brother, we can't control the way we speak each other. We got no vaccine to recover, not lovers of disease. Lovers of disease. Oh, 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 lovers of the seas. Weary, patient, complex, and gone is white as snow. Breathe vapors to recreate the blood flow. Deep daydream to teach you what you've never known. Fun neighbors, they have no room to grow. Have no room to grow. Oh, ho, ho. have no room to grow. Take pictures to capture for the ones we grieve. Disease sister, she told me I should work on knees. They blister, we'd eat forbidden food if it please. Mister, mister, so they rest at ease. So they rest at ease. Oh, ho, oh, oh. so they rest at ease. So my band Honey Glaze is, uh, we're working on releasing more music. We have three songs out right now that are on Spotify and all other platforms. We've got like 10 songs in the bank right now that we're working on. We will be releasing a new song soon. I'm really excited to share the next piece of our, of our catalog with everyone and to continue to progress and make cool stuff that is fun to make, that, that is um, something that I hope people will just put on and have a good time listening to. So The Others is a song that was fairly easy for me to write. There was something about that track when I worked on it initially with um, Thaddeus, who's my bandmate. But when he wrote that um, chord progression and kind of got the first drum loops going, I, I instantly knew that it was something that I was excited to write for. There's something so hauntingly beautiful about it. Um, and I've always gravitated towards those things, things that kind of contradict. But overall, I think that the song is a perfect example of how I like to create emotions that I can really only express through writing music and finding that outlet. Read 
in my label Hope place Read in my face Read in my face Read in my label Thank you.